join the women's department tonight for fourth Sunday Night Fire at 6 p.m. in the sanctuary. Scheduled to speak tonight are Evangelist Shannon Prevo, Evangelist Evangela Williams, and Evangelist Vicki Adams. The Greater Triangle District Consecration Union will take place August 27th and 28th at Grace Church of God in Christ with Pastor Michael Woodard. The church is located at 910 West Tarboro Road in Wilson, and the theme is Influencing One Another for the Glory of God from Matthew 5, 13 through 14. Service will begin both nights at 730. The fourth Tuesday night men's meeting will be held August 28th at 730 p.m. in the Fellowship Hall. All men are encouraged to attend. The NC 3rd Kojak Academy is still accepting applications for the fall semester scheduled to begin Saturday, September 22nd. All requests for registration applications must be submitted via email to registrar at nc 3rd kojakacademycom Join Bishop Wooden along with the Love Life Triangle Pro-Life Organization for a prayer walk to be held Saturday, September 1st from 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. The walk will commence at 1522 Jones Franklin Road in Raleigh. Everyone is invited to attend. Children's Church will resume Sunday, September 9th, and teachers, along with youth workers, are needed. If you have a heart for children and enjoy teaching the Word of God, please contact Elder Curtis Terry or send an email to youarechildrenschurch at gmail.com. Greetings, Bishop Wooden and First Lady, Elder Harry and Carolyn Burwell from Detroit, Michigan. When we moved here last year to North Carolina, one of our first goals was to find a new Church of God in Christ church home. We individually checked on the internet and the Lord led us both to the upper room Church of God in Christ, so we joined. Bishop, you have blessed our souls tremendously. The Lord has fulfilled our dream of the type of church we were looking for, a church of prayer, praise, worship, and preaching the word and living according to the Bible. The Bishop, blesses us every Thursday and Sunday night with a word from the Lord. He expounds on that word to each of us daily. Bishop, we appreciate you. We are very happy to have made your acquaintance. It's been one of our dreams has been to be in a church where the gospel is being preached and you are man's man. Uh, you're not afraid to attack issues that concern the church, the lesbian, and, and abortion, and homosexuality, all these things which the Bible speaks about. You're man enough to stand up and declare the gospel truth according to what the Bible has said about that. And we appreciate you for that. We are very happy to be here. And happy anniversary to you and First Lady. We love you both. Jeremiah 3 and 15 states that I will give you pastors after my heart, which shall feed you with knowledge and understanding. Congratulations on your 31st anniversary, Bishop Wooden. It is an honor to sit under you and learn, not only from your teaching, but from your example. Your life and your ministry has not only strengthened our marriage, but our family as well. We are grateful to God for allowing us to be a part of such a great ministry for over 14 years. It is our prayer that God will continue to strengthen and keep you, First Lady, and your family. We, we love, love you. you. Happy, Happy anniversary. anniversary. God bless you, Bishop Wooden and First Lady Wooden. Bishop, we want to thank you for your faithful spiritual leadership throughout the years. You are a man driven by the things of God. Your preached word has inspired, encouraged, and strengthened my family to continue to fight the good fight of faith by honoring the God of the Bible. Our prayer is that you continue to stand your ground and preach with the full armor of God. On behalf of the Bowens and Ship family, happy, happy anniversary, anniversary, Bishop Wooden. Wooden.